I want you to listen to this poem. It's about a, ro a robin redbreast, which we have, who we have been talking about a lot lately. And I hope you've been seeing and identifying robins in your backyard and on your walks outside and when you're on your scooter and when you're on your bicycle. Robins are good to be able to identify. It's nice to know what's happening outside in the, in the natural world. So this poem is called Niddle Noddle. Now you'll have to listen to it and see if there's any movements you can make up to go with this poem. It's very short. Niddle Noddle. Little Robin Redbreast sat upon a rail. Niddle Noddle went his head. Wiggle Waggle went his tail. Did you hear anything in there that you could do? I wonder what you could do when you hear the words Niddle Noddle with his, went his head. Or what can you do when it says Wiggle Waggle went his tail? Hmm. Let's see if you can come up with some good movements for this one. Here, let's try it again so you can practice your movements. Niddle Noddle. Little Robin Redbreast sat upon a rail. Niddle Noddle went his head. Wiggle Waggle went his tail. Shall we do it again? Then you can do your movements again. Little Robin Redbreast sat upon a rail. Niddle Noddle went his head. Wiggle Waggle went his tail. Well, this is a poem that you could recite for your mom and dad, grandmas and grandpas. You can do this oh, for any family or any friends, and you can show this to them when you when you talk to them over the. You can recite it for them over the poem over the phone, but you could also show it to them if you did any um, zooming or FaceTiming or Google Meetups with anyone that's in your family or one of your friends. I hope you enjoy practicing and performing this cute little poem about a robin.